students i am dr modushri haldar from sri rampur girls college uh, in our second semester syllabus we have taxonomy practical and uh, in this syllabus we have one family that is labiati or lamiaceae family and under this family we have uh, two genus to dissect out or work out it that is uh, leucus and uh, leonurus Uh, today we have um, tried to uh, uh, to work out uh, the leonurus sivericus and this is a single twig of leonurus sivericus uh, as you see that uh, that is a uh, terrestrial plant actually and perennial i have collected it from hubli mohsin college and adjacent area and uh, uh, this is uh, this plant belongs to labiati or lamiaceae family uh, this is the uh, single twig of leonurus sibiricus as you see that the leaves of this uh, genus is actually uh, simple and uh, in the arrangement or phyllotaxy of leaf is uh, opposite decussed the leaves are uh, actually uh, palmate in shape and uh, the stem another important character of uh, leonurus sivericus is the stem is actually quadrangular or rectangular in shape okay you can see that the cutted portion of the stem it is actually quadrangular or rectangular in shape uh, if we cut down the Um, stem with a sharp object that is either blade or uh, a scissor then we will see the this portion the quadrangular stem of leonurus sibiricus okay uh, next uh, thing is the uh, inflorescence of leonurus or labiati family that is uh, the inflorescence type is verticillaster uh, you can see that the inflorescence is um, verticillaster type that is the um, that is all the flowers um, arranged in a false hole around the stem if we cut down one single inflorescence then we see this what is cluster inflorescence type that is a single inflorescence of leonurus sivericus that is the actually arrangement of flowers in a false hole okay okay next thing is the flower if we come to the portion single flower a single flower we have isolated uh, from the inflorescence that is a single flower of leonurus sibiricus and uh, the flower is approximately 2 to uh, 2 cm to 2.5 cm flower of leonurus and uh, you can see that the um, calyx is actually uh, gamosepalous all the members of uh, the calyx that is sepals are fused and five in number the calyx is bell shaped uh, so and uh, Uh, another character is important diagnostic character of this family is bilabiate corolla you can see that that is the bilabiate corolla of leonurus sivericus and uh, if we dissect out if we dissect out then you can see that is the corolla along with the 
along with the um, stamens or endoecium and gynoecium part and uh, that is actually the calyx portion I will show you that is actually the calyx portion of Leonidas so you can see in detail the calyx is bell shaped and sepals are 5 in number ok next we have to dissect out the uh, androecium gynoecium portion from this bilabiate ok we have to dissect out Okay, just uh, give a small incision and open out, open it. So, we have opened it the, and uh, you can see the androecium of Leonidas sibiricus uh, four in number and uh, the arrangement of androecium actually didynamous or uh, two plus two arrangement of androecium okay so we have to put it on a slide and Okay. Okay. So that is the whole thing. That is the process of giving an incision and separate it out from the calyx and corolla okay that is the calyx i have opened up the bell-shaped calyx that is this whole calyx bell-shaped calyx and here in the right side that is the open sepals because that is gamosepalus okay next thing I have tried to separate out the gynoecium from this flower okay Okay, these are the four hmm. androecium or anthers. The filaments are long enough and we have to separate out the gynoecium. Okay, you can see that that is the gynoecium portion. Okay. That is the gynoecium. Just put some water. 
ओके सो दैट इज द गाइनेशियम ऑफ लियोनोरस सिबरिकस दैट इज ओवरी एज वी नो दैट द ओवरी इज सुपीरियर एंड दैट इज द ओवरी दैट इज द स्टाइल एंड द इम्पॉर्टेंट एंड डायग्नोस्टिक कैरेक्टर ऑफ लेबिएटी फैमिली इज द stigma the stigma is divided into okay as we see the stigma the stigma portion is bifurcated and that is the diagnostic character of laviati family okay so and that is another so these are the uh, all four parts of all four parts of all four parts of um, leonurus that's why leonurus is a complete flower okay okay that is a single anther of there is a single anther of leonurus and the anther is actually bilobed okay there is a single anther of leonurus okay okay next come to the portion fruit of leonurus here is the fruit of leonurus inside the persistent calyx and the type of fruit is carceriole okay you can see the fruit of leonurus inside the persistent calyx okay try to dissect out the fruit also okay and try to see the fruit of leonurus okay so that is the fruit of leonurus sibiricus dissect it out okay so that is the fruit of leonurus sevicus the type of fruit is carceriole okay so this are the parts of floral parts of leonidas sibiricus uh, actually uh, we have um, to do another more thing but that is impossible to do in home that is the cross section of ovary and uh, the floral formula so from home these all are possible and uh, i have done it from for my students that's all